it's often that you meet people who want you to stay in the same dimension, in the same place, in the same reality. They want to put a ceiling on your dreams. They want you to believe that everything that you see and everything that you feel is dependent upon their opinion. But look at the people who's talking to you. Read what some people write and look at the negativity involved. See, I have learned that some people live in a small space. It's like restricted, incarcerated in their own thoughts and feelings in a 10 by 10 area. Sometimes it's a chair or a couch or dance floor or picnic area. But it's that same place, that same space. And any time you talk of stepping out of the boundaries of those confined spaces, you have become the enemy. You have become resistant. You have become someone that they fear. And their opinions reflect their fear because their fear is your success. Their fear is that ceiling that you refuse to put above yourself. Their fear is that space that you refuse to confine yourself to. See, you ever heard people say you need to step out of the box? Well, sometimes when you step out of the box, it's things waiting for you from inside the box, trying to pull you back into the box. Now, the only way that can happen is if you hear the yells and the screams and the loud voices and those negative opinions of you outside the box. Why would you step out of a box to listen to the people who you were confined in the box with? They don't know anything outside of the box. So how could a person inside a box give you advice and suggestions on what's happening outside of a box if they never been outside the box? If they so afraid to step outside the box, wouldn't that be fear? See, they don't really know what's outside the box because they've lived a life afraid of what's outside the box. And once you stepped out there, they have told you for so many years of the dangers of what was outside the box. And that is the only thing that they have to live by. Is the fear of what's outside the box. Oh, if you step outside the box, you won't be able to make it. You won't be able to eat. Your dreams won't come true and the sky will come falling down. That's an illusion. That's a thought, a negative thought, a toxic thought. That is the thought of those of us who sometimes incarcerate our own minds through our own psychological beliefs, if not those given to us by people who have put us in the box and we in the box with them and we share our opinions and our views and our fears of what's outside the box. You ever notice the people who step outside the box? They don't care what you thinking inside the box because they know that you don't know any more than what's inside that box. You only know fear. Fear, fear, fear. God hates fear. Successful people do not thrive off of fear. Fear is the ultimate pessimism. That's what it is. Pessimistic views of things, especially what exists outside the box. Sometimes, let's take that chance. It don't matter what age you are, 
It don't matter if you're short or tall, if you're fat or skinny. It don't matter if you're rich or poor. If you have placed your dreams and your thoughts in a psychological box and allow people to reinforce that box to the point that you are willing to accept your whole life inside the confines of the box. You are willing to accept that the sky is not the limit. You are willing to accept that fear is greater than love or joy or achievement or success or change or transformation or the belief and faith in God that there is more in store for you than what's in a box. Do you really think that God brought us here for us to live in a box, to be restricted to small spaces? Some of us, we go to the same place every week, do the exact same thing every week. Even education, Sometimes we don't want to step outside the box and learn new words and new perspectives and correct the things that we don't know. We accept the belief that inside the box is safe and secure and that's where everything's happening. When sometimes all we gotta do is step out of the box. I'm Dan Land Pro. Don't forget, Webmaster Dan or Dan Land Pro youtube.com make sure you subscribe peace